Hello everyone and welcome to the Ants Underground Kingdom. This is going to be my comprehensive buying guide to paid events. So let's get into it. Now, currently we have this cave exploration event, but these same sort of uh, buying tips will apply to any paid event. All right, we're already a couple days in here. That's why I already have some points, but you should be doing this from the very first day of a paid event all the way through the event, okay? Now, there's always going to be a $1, a $5, and a 10 or $20 package options, or $1, 10 and 20 something like that these cheap packages are always going to be the most efficient okay as you can see here one dollar for one dice roll here and this is a selective dice roll this is the only one worth buying in this event by the way here we have five dollars for six dice and then ten dollars for 12 dice now you can see this $50 package, well that's $50 for 4 dice, that's only a 4 to 5 ratio instead of a, a 6 to 5 ratio. So you're losing efficiency with these more expensive packages. Alright, so the idea is to get these cheapest packages every day of the event and there's always going to be diamond packages which you'll want to get all three of these every day okay so get those three get these cheaper packages here go ahead and I'll just do this live on camera here That package, this $5 one here, as you can see, yes, yeah, still $5, the 6 to 5 ratio here. I'll talk about how much things actually cost closer to the end. But every event is going to be similar to this. There's going to be three cheaper packages that are going to be the most efficient. You need to be patient and essentially buy these every day of the event. And I'll tell you what to do on the last day of the events. Okay. So there we have the three cheapest packages. And we have received 24 dice from that and a selective dice. I've already done some dailies today, so may as well get these. Every event, you'll be able to get three things from dailies, just like this. So you'll have your five days of dailies. You'll have five days of spending diamonds for whatever the event package thing is. And you'll have five days of buying the three cheapest packages, okay? Doing this is usually enough to buy these $3,600 packages here. Now, if you want to get a more expensive package, like these three or this one here, they're going to cost more than just those base cheap packages for five days, right? So you may want to start looking into these packages here. I'm thinking about getting one of these other things here, so I'll show you how the efficiency works. Buying these more expensive items, you will have to buy some of these decreased efficiency packages, right? So these four to five ratio packages. Now, one thing you can do every day, and every event is like this, they'll have a couple cheaper packages that are equally as efficient as this $50 package. So this is still 4 to 5, 4 to 5. They're both less efficient than our main three packages we already bought, but 
They're the next next best efficiency you can get outside of the cheap ones, right? And th these hundred dollar packages are way less efficient for the event items. I would never recommend buying those ever. Since I plan on maybe getting one of these, we will uh, go ahead and get a couple of these and I'll show you how that works out. So here we have four to five. Get that one. Really expensive video, huh? Watch as your money drains away into oblivion. Here we still have a 4 to 5 ratio. Not bad. So this will add a 15 every day. And help kind of spread it out. But this is still equally as efficient as buying these $50 packages. Now here we have 15 for 20. That's not the same as 4 to 5. It's actually one less. But you do get a decent amount of eggs and other stuff. I might get this package later. We'll see. But essentially after this package, the efficiency decreases even more and I wouldn't recommend them anymore. At that point, just get the, the $50. Okay. And honestly, never get the $100. If you're going for the event items, this ratio is insane, you know. It's twice as expensive. This should be 80 dice, not 56. Don't get those. Alright. So, to reiterate, spend your diamonds every day. Get the $1 package and... In this case, the 5 and $10 package. In other events, it might be 10 and 20 But the concept remains the same. Alright, and what you'll do after 5 days of buying those cheapest packages, you will get an idea of how many points you'll average per dice roll, in this case, or whatever the event item is. And on this last day, you'll just essentially have to buy $50 packages or these cheaper packages that I already bought earlier in order to make up the difference. Okay, sometimes you'll have to just buy one, sometimes two, it depends really on what you're going for in the actual store here. This is the cheapest way to get what you want. You just have to be patient for five days. I'll make another video about what to buy and how much all this stuff actually costs just to give you an idea of where to best put your money if you do sp plan on spending anything, etc. So, I'll see you next time.